Hey guys, it's Kate and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I have a Trixie Cosmetics, I guess spring launch. She's been coming out with so many fun collaborations. I definitely splurged on the daytime TV realness and the Back to the Fuchsia. And now the newest one, the Bottle Blonde Collection. I had to grab a couple pieces from as well. So I got my box in the mail and it is a compact box. <laughs> It's tiny, but there's a lot of stuff in here, so I'm just gonna jump on in and show you. Right on top is just my packing slip, so it has all of the items that I purchased and for their totals, so good information to have. And then the first thing, packed nice and tight, is this Trixie Cosmetics Lilac Sweet Embroidered Heart Bubble in the um, Tea in the Heart Bubble sweatshirt. Now I do live in Florida, so this is definitely very Florida appropriate <laughs> um, attire, but I love a good sweatshirt and I have her um, navy, not navy blue, like I'd say true blue sweatshirt from the Daytime Realness collection and it says crew on the back, like you're part of her TV crew and I love it. I wear it usually on Fridays when we're watching Drag Race, so I thought I could roll this into my Friday Drag Night apparel. Look how cute the little embroidered tee is. Oh, I love it. So sweet. So that was um, 50. There's that. And then Stop it right now. I literally just organized all of my scrunchies before I sat down to do this video. So I'm gonna have to <laughs> put these in my collection, but I could not pass these up. Look at these were $10 for the two, making them $5 each. So the purple one has the same, no, I'm sorry, the pink one has the same logo on the sweatshirt where it's got the T in the heart. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that. But the purple one is just the little heart bubble, which is so cute. Oh my goodness, so cute. And then the final three things that I got were actual makeup items from the collection. So I'll show the lip glosses first. I got um, Press On and Hater. The other two were I Am Baby and um, High Ponytail, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but I'm finding more as I play with makeup with lip products. I just like matte colors. For glitters, I like to do the glitters on my eyes or like actual body glitter around where you would put highlight like on the tops of your cheekbones um, but I'm not really loving glitter on my lips so both of the other colors I'm Baby and High Ponytail had glitter in them so I passed so this is press on that's what the bottle looks like we know that I am not a swatch queen but I will try my best I just think that's a really beautiful moth color for spring, and I really like the smell of Trixie's makeup also. So this one is Hater. So this one is definitely darker, like a dark, um, I'd say more of almost like a kind of purpley brown. It is very dark in my room right now. I definitely use natural light to film. Um, and it's like 11 o'clock in the afternoon, so I thought I would be okay. But I feel like it's very dark in here, so I hope that you guys can see that. So this one, um, Hater, is definitely going to be, I think, dark for me, but still very fun to play with. Probably more a fall color for me than anything else. And then probably the thing... I am most excited about was the eyeshadow palette. Stop it right now. Look. It is her first um, 12 pan palette. The Daytime Realness I think was an 8 or an had to be an 
eight pan palette because I think it's two rows of four. Um, but this one is 12 pan. So, oh, I want to save that. So the um, sleeve is the same packaging as the actual, what is this called? <laughs> like palette cover itself. It's so cute. And then here is the inside. I'm going to try very hard not to blind you. Okay. And then the back is interesting. It says it's um, like the different weights or the amounts for each of the colors. And nine of them are 2.1 grams. Um, two of them are 2.2 grams and one is 1.5. So they are different sizes, but they don't look different sizes to me. That is so interesting. I don't know. I couldn't tell you which ones are 2.1, 2.2, or 1.5. That's crazy. They look the same. They look the same um, uh, sizes to me. But I'm gonna go ahead and quickly just do light swatches on my arm, and then I'll come back and show you the swatches on my skin color, on my skin tone. So that is everything from the collection that I purchased. There are, I'm like fully <laughs> marked up on this arm. Um, there are two other lip glosses, like I mentioned. There is a heart mirror, which is too precious, but I do my makeup in my bathroom mirror, so I definitely do not need a handheld mirror. And there, I believe, is also an accessories pack, so you get different stickers and pins and patches and things like that. <laughs> Got it all over the sand too. Um, but. I'm good on all of those things. I definitely just tried to stick to the things that I knew I would use and love, trying to be very mindful about um, all my shopping, especially since as a teacher, I'm going into summer and I will not be making income for <laughs> the next two months. But of course I had to support my favorite drag queen and I just love everything that she puts out. So I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. It's super fun for me to get to play with all of these items. And I especially can't wait to play with all of the pinks and purples for summertime. What I want to know is who your favorite drag queen is. And if it does happen to be Trixie, if you have any of her makeup collection as well. Um, because I'm just super curious to watch other people here on YouTube playing with all kinds of drag queen makeup and seeing the looks they come up with and things like that. So I will talk to you guys next time. Bye <laughs> from my makeup hands. <laughs>